Hey everyone, today I'm sharing some of the trackers I've got set up in Zinnia. So starting with this week layout, I've got my tasks and stuff here for the week and I like to have my trackers linked from here so that I can have that easy reminder to keep up with them whenever I'm looking at my day. The first tracker is for student loans. I wrote the loan balance over here and each of these diplomas represents a $350 monthly payment. I used the line to write the date of the payment. It's great looking on here to see how far you've come. It's just really satisfying. If you don't have student loans, first of all, lucky you. But there are also other money trackers in Xenia's studio, like emergency savings and mortgage and some other stuff. Okay, next is books. I love this book tracker because it has a rating and a place for notes. My memory is not what it used to be, so it's nice to look back and get my thoughts, especially if I want to recommend a book to someone. The last one is cheating a bit because it's more than one habit. Basically, I have my daily and weekly goals and I just check off the ones I've done every day. So all the trackers I've shown you are pre-created spreads that you can find whenever you type in book tracker or whatever you're looking for. I like the pre-made ones because they're fast and you can ungroup elements to personalize them. If you search tracker in the studio, you'll get lots of options. Or if you check out one of the full journals like this Blossom Planner here, they also have trackers. And this final one is not a tracker I use all year, but it's for my November writing challenge. I color a petal in every day that I hit my writing goal. That's it for now. Thanks for watching.